السلام عليكم ورحمة الله In January 1984 after opening the bank account to deposit all the fundraising uh, fund in it we started actively me and Dr. Hassan to raise fund he was acting as the treasurer and I was acting as the fundraiser we used to go from street to street in Birmingham mosque to mosque and shop to shop and so on to raise fund uh, for the victims of the famine in uh, Eritrea and Tigray especially at the time part of Ethiopia in August 1984 it was the uh, my second visit to Sudan to attend the conference about implementation of uh, Islamic Sharia in Khartoum under the auspices of the late President um, Ja'far uh, Al-Numeri Rahmatullah Ali and uh, the Sudanese uh, brothers whom I knew invited me to attend the uh, conference. At the time, in this eight months, between January and August, uh, we raised about uh, 5,000 pounds, and we were actually engaged with the local organization to do something for the people in the east of Sudan who came from Eritrea. Uh, many people, many guests were, were invited from Arab uh, world and from uh, Islamic world and from different Islamic groups and Jama'at and others to attend this historical event. Sudan actually has many culture, many languages, and many religions in there. What uh, made me extremely upset is the statements of some individuals from the Gulf who had nothing to do with understanding the mechanics of the culture of the different community living in Sudan. One of them was actually, yani, uh, cursing, not cursing, but uh, uh, undermining the credibility and the integrity of the non-Muslims in Sudan. The second one said in his uh, speech in the parliament in Omudurman, which is uh, was there, that is his country. It was the only country who was implementing Islamic Sharia at the time. This kind of arrogance and superiority complex at the back of the mind of certain individuals does not help the community to survive together, does not reconcile and facilitate the process of community building or cohesion. At the time also a lot of guests such as Muhammad Ali was there and he gave a very good speech. Also there was an immigration of the Annelain, the Two Niles uh, Mosque uh, in Omdurman. A lot of people were there. And I was put in touch with the local organization to try to find a project to support the Eritrean uh, refugees. So our first project was uh, to support a chicken farm in the east of Sudan, uh, being uh, established to support uh, the refugees who crossed the border from uh, Ethiopia to Sudan. So during this conference, international conference, I learned a lot. I saw a lot of uh, so-called uh, so-called uh, preachers, Muslim preachers, dua, uh, scholars, which is, they were neither dua nor scholars, not even Muslim preachers, because they don't know what they are talking about, especially when they come to a big country like Sudan with a conflict here and there with different culture, different uh, values for the people and different religion. I learned a lot as well in my second journey. And this was a historical uh, conference of printing Sharia. And uh, one of the days, everybody was bringing the wine and uh, uh, what they call it, uh, drinks and pouring it into the streets of Khartoum, 
whether this was a demonstration or show or what you call what else you call or a stage management a managed uh, show or whatever it is but it was real and people were actually uh, very joyful very happy to see them doing that what is sharia now in sudan we have to ask people living in sudan assalamu alaikum warahmatullahi